Hey everyone, I hope that everything is going great with you, with your friends and with your family. My name is Jordan Mendieta and today we are going to talk about Lima, Peru. Let's start it. our mind gonna be Incas or just Machu Picchu because it's one of the wonders of the world. Uh, it's like uh, when you go to Mexico and the first thing that come to your mind gonna be Aztecas and Mayas. Just that. Well, but when you visit to Peru for first time, don't just think in Cusco. If we investigate a little bit more, we have many other things to do here. And in this video, I'm going to explain to you the top 10 things that we could do in Lima and in other regions next to Lima. Let's start it. Lima is the capital of Peru and this wonderful city offers to you many options to visit. If you really like the history, the historical center is a great opportunity to know how was the colonial time in Lima. It's also considered the city of kings and queens. Many people around the world call this city like the Balconies City because we could find more than 500 balconies in all this wonderful place. Also, Lima is fantastic, the people is great, the food, the energy, everything is amazing. When you are walking through the avenues, each street has a thousand stories to share with you. Number 2. Pachacamac. This is a wonderful place with a lot of history before the Spanish people come here. Also, if you are planning to go to Cusco and to visit Machu Picchu, it's a great opportunity to know this wonderful archaeological zone, located just a 35 minutes far from Miraflores and San Isidro. Something very important. Let's remember that the Incas are the result of the knowledge and skills of different cultures that existed before. Incas is the last part of our history that started in 1438 until 1532 approximately. So, this is a great opportunity to visit this place and to understand the history much better before than the Incas existed. Scientists recommend to come here first to go to Machu Picchu. Number 3. Swimming with the sea lion. If you really like the ocean and adventure, this is a wonderful experience that you cannot lose. Just located 45 minutes far from Lima, you could practice this experience in Palominos Island that is very close to Callao's port. It's the unique place that you could practice this wonderful experience. Imagine yourself swimming with more than a hundred and a hundred sea lions. It's an experience that you just have to live. You just can't imagine the experience. Number 4. Magic Water Shore Park. If you really like to explore the night time, Lima offered to you a fantastic option holograms, Japanese technology, laser, music and more than 13 fountains in this wonderful park gonna make an unforgettable experience for you. It's a great option for everyone, you could go with a couple, with your family or just by yourself. Don't lose this experience at night, many people like to do a dinner show after this. That's gonna be an option up to you.
Number 5. Gastronomical experience. If you really like to eat and learn about gastronomy, you have many options in Lima. Already, Lima is considered the capital of gastronomy of all South America. More of the people visit first a typical market and after that they receive lessons on how to make a delicious ceviche and you're gonna enjoy it with a traditional pisco sour. Number 6. Museums in Lima. If you really like to visit the museums, we could recommend Larco Museum or the Archaeological Museums and both are located just 40 minutes far from Miraflores and very close to the historical center. Those museums are considered the most popular in Lima and Larco Museum have the popular erotic area and it's considered in the 20 best museums around the world. If you really like to learn our past and our history, this is a wonderful opportunity to visit these amazing museums. Number 7. Traditional Communities in Lima If you're a person that we would like to learn about society, how people live, educational system, real life of the people, to visit the traditional communities will be a fantastic idea. Plus than 75% of the population live in a traditional community in Lima. Those neighborhoods sometimes are compared with favelas, but are not dangerous. Those are friendly communities that you could visit if you organize it. Huaycán, located in the east, is one of the most popular for the traditional markets, the archaeological sites, the schools, the food, the weather and the energy of the people. All of them they're gonna receive to you with a welcoming smiles. There is many options to visit around Lima, but Waikang is one of the most popular because have an ancestral heritage that make unique this wonderful highland place. We could recommend to visit if you organize it very well. Miski! Number 8. Paracas Ica Huacachina. If you're spending a few days in Lima, this is a wonderful experience that you cannot lose. More of the people do this experience in one day. Paracas is a province located in the south part of Lima. Here you can find a natural reserve that is compared with the Galapagos in the Ecuador. Yes, with wildlife animals around, penguins, many different kind of sea lions and different kind of birds also. The make unique in this wonderful reserve is the natural landscape of the desert around. After this, more of the people go far to visit Huacachina, that is the unique oasis in America. Yes, in the whole continent is the unique oasis. Here, you could experiment the adrenaline of your body and you could practice the sandboarding and the four wheelers or boogies around the dunes. With this wonderful landscape, gonna make your experience unique. More of the people after this go to visit the vineyards around. Of that way, you could learn how we make and how and you could taste the most important alcoholic drink of the country, that is the Pisco. Don't forget to make this experience. Number 9. Carao. It's considered the oldest civilization in America, even older than Egypt, with more than 5,000 years old. Carao it's an archaeological site that we can find more than 23 different kind of pyramids. Yes, pyramids all around this wonderful place. If you wanna feel like Indiana Jones, you could visit this wonderful place located in the north of Lima. More of the people usually do a full day tour to experiment this wonderful place. Number 10. Nazca Lines. This is one of the most popular places that you could visit very close to Lima. People around the world come to this place and spend one night before to do the flight at the next morning. 
Usually, that they do is to mix the tours visiting Ferris, Paracas Natural Reserve, and then the unique oasis in America that is Ica Huacachina. Why is very popular this place? Because the unique way to see these wonderful drawings 200 years after Jesus Christ is with plane. It's an amazing, an amazing place to visit that you cannot lose if you have the opportunity. Yeah, to try to organize it very well, try to look for a very uh, interesting tourism company and do it. You never ever gonna forget this wonderful experience. At the same time, why they spent more just the one day in all this tour is because they could find many other places to visit around, like the aqueducts for example, more than 23 aqueducts that the Nazca culture did it before. So, it's an experience that you're never ever gonna forget visiting. Well guys, I hope that you really liked this video. Uh, before to finish it, maybe you're thinking to travel very soon to Peru and to visit Lima, I could recommend a tourism agency located in this wonderful city, that is Culture Peru. They're gonna help you to organize your trip and mold your experience. Yeah, even if you have just an opinion or question, you could ask them. I'm gonna let the website and all the social medias below, yes? And you just ask them because they're gonna help you because you're not a tourist for them. You're not a tourist for us. You're already part of our family. Please, don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel to follow us in our social mediums and just let us know your opinion. Please, that's gonna help to us a lot like a feedback, write us below and that's gonna help to us a lot. I don't wanna say bye just like that. Uh, I would like to teach you a very important word to say thank you in an Inca language, in Quechua. To say thank you in Quechua is Jus Parasunki. So, Jus Parasunki Walkikunas. Take care.